notice that this barbed wire was cut here. See over there, it's all intact. But yep. here, it's cut. I thought that's weird, so I tried radioing Jimmy to find out if he had cut it for a reason. Sometimes he does things like that. And that's when I said, well, let me go look in the back. I could immediately see broken glass. That's when I just kind of took off to went to investigate. Oh, here's the place. What's going on? They only got truck seven? It's the only one they touched. Wow, look at that. Well, what I don't get is they left the sewer machine. They, now, the $3,000 line location equipment, the rigid Nava track still here. Power tools are missing. The, the color reel for this, um, that goes with this monitor for video inspecting sewer lines is missing. There's a heavy rotary hammer at drill bits that's missing. We need a couple dogs, like a, a Doberman, a nice shepherd. Right. We could take some block out of there and have a, a two-way door. The problem is there's liability if a sales guy comes in and they bite him. The salesman shouldn't be here after hours. We've been through this before, you know. At this location? No, no, at the other location. And what we had to do, I, I had to design special bars to fit on the back of the trucks. You know, it would slow them up. I figured if they're going to break in, they might as well earn it. Instead of just making it that easy for them, snap a lock and, you know, gone. He's going to have to really work at it you know, to get in here. And we have a, a lock that's supposed to go here. And look where it's at. It's right here. Isn't that marvelous? This is supposed to go here. <coughs> why, is that, it, why is it up on that handle? Uh, because he's lazy or stupid or a combination of both. Because that's more than a padlock right there. That goes way deeper than just a padlock, not on a hasp. You just give them all the uh, the, the tools to work with and, and the, the lock needs to go on the hasp. I mean, that's a simple concept. The lock goes on the hasp. See, here's how it should be locked. and then what happens to it? Do they sell it to a pawn shop, get some quick money for a couple of rocks, you know, smoke some crack, get a little buzz going, go to the next place. It's quick money. But they knew that video reel, you know, that was probably $7,000 reel. That was a really gutsy move on their part, not to access these sides to go to the front, but uh, that's what they did, and we'll get to the bottom of it. All the equipment is engraved. Company phone number, my driver's license number, and we'll get it back one way or the other. We will get it back. Christians, Muslims, Hindus, Buddhists, Bloods, Crips, Teamsters, Nudists, Democrat, Republicans. You won't believe it, they hit him again. But this time they really hit him. They hit all the trucks. You gotta be shitting me. No. Chevy, Al Qaeda, all can set you free if you This can go towards our deductible. What is that, Dan? We're missing. Know a great plumber or have a great plumbing story? Flush TV is accepting ideas for its next season of episodes. Shoot us an email at info at flushtv.com.